Hi, it's Alex from Road Selection, and this particular video is all about why some private equity firms outperform their competitors by more than industry average. So, basically, how to be or what the very best in the industry uh, are doing um, with regards to growing their portfolio businesses and getting those fantastic multiples. So, firstly, number one is they have a very focused and dedicated origination, which is very detailed, very process orientated, but also they also use external expertise. So, we've done a great um, blog post and video uh, or vlog, as it's now called, uh, on origination and how the best companies are doing that. So, this will be absolutely critical is to get that process correct, have particular step stages and processes in place to identify the right businesses, then assess them, do the right due diligence, and then look at obviously progressing or, or declining on that basis. So number two is sharing the spoils. So the very top businesses really engage their senior management in, within their portfolio businesses and also their investment professionals maybe across the wider business in the operational finance as well within the actual PE uh, and VC firm, but incentivizing effectively the senior management within the portfolio businesses, um, typically sitting as a share of spoils um, across the whole senior management team between 15 to 20 percent, really incentivize as is those individuals, gives them that skin in the game and it ups that ability for you guys to be able to get a great valuation um, and a fantastic exit with a great multiple on there. Dedicating uh, more time uh, within the initial phase after securing the the particular portfolio business. So we've actually done a little bit of a bit of due diligence on this with uh, uh, sorry a bit of uh, reporting on this with uh, with some of the firms that uh, we work with and also firms we've had been speaking with. So we did a bit of a survey and it, it looks like the firms that have the best percentage success rates with portfolio businesses with the the hundred the first hundred days is absolutely crucial with identifying um, where the business is going to go, what are the key challenges, what are the key issues. Issues, what does the talent look like within the business and spending typically the the investor um, the vice president prin, uh, principal partner will spend uh, within the top firms around 50% of their time within that hundred days um, looking at all the different aspects and really getting involved within the portfolio business against some of the underperforming ones which is 20% or less so you know if you're getting to that 50% mark it's highly likely that you're gonna have some success with uh, with what you're doing with that particular portfolio business so definitely spending more time with those uh, with those portfolios in those first hundred days is absolutely crucial and and don't think that once you've signed on that line that job is done that's really where it all starts uh, last one which is probably one of the more you know more relevant and more passionate areas for definitely for myself and for the business at raw selection is um, expelling the leaders that just don't cut it fast so if you've got underperforming people within the portfolio business, and we're not just talking about the CEO here, let's have a really look at the you know the holistic view right of all across the whole business and understand who are the top performers, who are the underperformers, and is it possible to be able to bring people into the business um, that are going to be able to create that further upturn, create that further development within the firm. So understanding the portfolio, understanding the senior management, their drivers, their motivators, uh, and making that call quick. The amount of firms that we speak with that have been, you know, two years, three years of underperformance and then looking at changing the CEO, the COO, the CFO, you know, the president, whoever it is, and then they're coming to us and saying, we need somebody, this is really urgent for us, you know, we, we wanted to do an exit in two years, then it's about getting that understood from the word go and making that exit fast um, and, and therefore taking that issue and that problem off the table for you uh, and moving it forward um, and bringing someone in that can just do it. So one of the key areas that, that we do a lot of work in is is when you need to do that particular transition and you don't want anybody to know, um, we will do a completely confidential search, go into the market, identify the right talent, give you the short list, do an, a non-disclosure agreement so nobody can discuss anything about it and then present you with a profile and you can make the necessary changes within the business knowing that you've got somebody already lined up to come in to do a transition period. 
So for the very best private equity venture capital uh, talent globally, uh, my contact is alex.r, that's the letter, at rawselection.co.uk, or you can visit us at www.rawselection.co.uk. Look forward to speaking to you soon. Thank you.